and I'm Melissa with Midnight Hour Oil, and I uh, hope you can hear me. I'm uh, on the road making a video. I was uh, I was thinking about the uh, the vision I had had a couple weeks ago, and then the word I received a few days before that about war, and I had asked everybody to be praying about that. Uh, kind of feeling like it was war with another country. Okay, but um, I just. I'm sure you've heard of this, some, some may not have, but uh, that group Antifa that uh, is uh, politically charged and uh, they're, they're planning to start chaos in the uh, streets across America, different cities this weekend. I think it's starting the 4th of November and um, they, uh, they say they want, you know, Trump out of the office of the president, they want, they're going to come against um, Trump supporters. So a heads up about that, like if, you know, you're going to be out and about anywhere near big cities in America, please be careful. Please, please pay attention to Holy Spirit. You know, when you, when you get that check in your spirit, like the Holy Spirit is saying, don't go down that street or you feel like you shouldn't, you know, go this way or that way. Please pay attention to that. That's Holy Spirit warning you. Um, in order to protect you, all right? So please uh, heed those warnings in your spirit. But um, I, uh, I'm i just wondering if the Lord wasn't warning us of a civil war uh, that's, that's getting ready to come down the pipe. Because, you know, what I heard is uh, they are going to start a war, okay? And, and I, I wasn't quite sure who they are, they. But, you know, it, it could be this Antifa group I don't know, but I know uh, we uh, just need to be in prayer about it. Please pray for the safety of the people uh, on the streets in the cities of America this weekend. And, you know, they say they're not going to stop. Like, this is going to be ongoing until they can get their way, whatever. Trump's out of the office. I don't know. But please be praying for our nation. Pray for the, the safety of the president. And, uh, and even the people that are involved in these uh, in these riots, because honestly, I don't think half of them really even understand what they're rioting about. I don't think they, uh, you know, they really know. Um, they need Jesus, just like all of us. They need Jesus. They need the peace of the Lord in their lives. Um, and uh, you know, our battle is not against flesh and blood. Our battle as the Apostle Paul tells us, is against the powers and the principalities, all right? It's against these wicked, dark forces in the spirit realm. So let's remember that, church, you know, who we're fighting against. It's, it's not people, even though people can be cruel and people can be violent toward us. Uh, that's, that's not where our battle is at. Our battle is in the spirit realm. Uh, the, the demonic forces that have taken those people captive and are using them uh, for the purposes of hell. Okay, so let's just use our greatest weapon of warfare, prayer, and uh, and just trust the Lord that, that He's going to intervene in, in all of this. Okay? Alright, so with that, uh, be safe this weekend. Um, and in the days ahead, it's hard to say how long this craziness is going to last before we're taken out of here. So, uh, it is always my prayer. We will all continue to keep our lamps burning bright while we wait for Jesus.